Sketchbook Tour 2022. Technically, I started this in 2021, December 2021, but it's 2022 now. I finished it. First time I've ever actually finished a sketchbook in like, what is it, like eight months? Usually I'd like start a sketchbook and I'll finish like a year, a year or two later. Uh, I think the longest I took was like five years to finish a sketchbook and my art's like not even crazy good. It was just always practice and I always stopped practicing and then I came back to it. And But here we are, 2022 sketchbook tour. All right, backstory on this sketchbook real quick. I started a challenge on TikTok. Uh, I'll fill a page every single day. As we're going along, you'll see like I had like a, a routine. I would like people leave comments of like, oh, draw this in there, draw that in there. And you'll see, I'll just try to fill the whole page with all that. Then some stuff happened, uh, family stuff happened, real life stuff happened. So I stopped drawing and then I just started drawing on my own time, stopped posting and uh, finished it up recently, about a week ago. And I'm about to start my next sketchbook for hitting 20K subscribers. And my goal is to fill up the sketchbook in either 12 hours or 24 hours. I haven't decided yet, but uh, let's get into this. First off, stickers everywhere. Teague, Teague Catch, Patreon stickers right here. 1000, some free thank you stickers. I forgot what it's from. Uh, some sticker company. Sticker Mule? No. I forgot. Primitive. My own sticker I made. I made this one. This one for my brother I made. And then my other brother. And then skateboarding. Thrasher, you know. Did you see that poser with the skateboard? <laughs> hey, yeah. skateboarder dude, why don't you uh, find a real identity? Because you're lying to yourself. I'm a taxpayer. What are you? A sax player in the in the band, you idiot? Yeah, probably. <laughs> That's a cool instrument, though. Nerd! Let's open this bad boy. Okay, page one. Started on December 8th, 2021. And I drew in it every day for like a month and then fell off. Failure. First page was just random web comic stuff. This is my characters, original characters, and then Spider-Man, because I didn't know what to do. Next page. Watch a lot of Craig of the Creek, man. And Green Poncho is probably my favorite character, so I drew a bunch of Green Ponchos. Um, I would just like Google images of Green Poncho and try to redraw them, not change the style. And then we have another one of my characters. His name is Eddie it's from my webcomic. Also, I also uh, practice cylinders a lot and shapes. Like every page, you'll see there'll be cylinders and squares. I don't know why. I just have to draw cylinders and squares all the time, everywhere. Not even just my sketchbook. There's that page. Page four. Uh, my character ZZ, the little sister, she wears Jordan 4s, that's what those are. They're supposed to be Jordan 4s, simplified. Drew some uh, squares to like show the form of the shoe. Circles, cylinders. My main character, Sky, he's a number one character. Mainly the story is based on him. So I was just doing like a bunch of facial expressions, trying to. Spider-Man as well. The villain. He looks a little too old though. Um, I didn't settle on a name, but he's supposed to be the villain. He's supposed to kind of look like the main character, but like a reverse version. Didn't settle on anything yet, but kind of what he's gonna look like. Okay, and then um, here's a bunch of like Miles, trying out different things, poses, head shapes, more cylinders. Uh, I was really trying poses here. I was using a action figure. I, I posted a video about this. I have an action figure, bunch of action figures actually. Okay. Took a picture of it in a certain pose and I would try to like redraw it for the anatomy. Um, day eight, I think I just seen No Way Home or No Way Home was like trending worldwide. It was December. I think it was around that time. So I had to draw a bunch of No Way Home stuff. And we got more of my comic book characters. This page looks like I didn't really do anything. Um, more of the villain, as you could tell, I changed him up a little bit. Let's see, let's go back to his original page. He's a little bit sharp here, a little bit pointy edges, and then here I rounded him off a little bit. Put a world on his shirt instead. I don't know, he tries to be cool. World peace, man, world peace. More cylinders. This one though, yeah, see I wrote this one, I like that one a lot. I want that one. Uh, main character, Sky again, circles and cylinders. Uh, Luca. Luca was a dope movie I love, still love. This is um Alberto. Alberto is like my favorite character maybe. I like Luca. A lot, but Alberto, Alberto, Silencio Bruno, he's like my favorite. Here's some more villain stuff. Trying to figure out his thin eyebrows, eyes, little squinty, little mouth, low mouth, I put, because I always wanted it to be at the bottom, but more cylinders. Um, This is when I start taking requests on a TikTok. I would be like, oh, what would you want to see me draw? And then somebody said Hollow Knight, so I did Hollow Knight. I never drew Hollow Knight before this, so I had to draw some Hollow Knight. 
Shoes is like a thing I really want to get better at. So I started filling up multiple pages, not just this sketchbook, with uh, shoes. Even on my iPad, I have a ton of shoes because my main characters are going to wear Jordan 1s, Dunks, uh, Jordan 4s. And I believe these are the 7, Jordan 7s? I don't remember. But I want emphasis to be on the shoes, kind of like Apple and Onion, if you ever watched Apple and Onion. Boom. My, probably my favorite page. Maddie Matheson was in an episode of Craig of the Creek. And when I was watching it, I was like, that sounds like Maddie Matheson. And it kind of looks like Maddie Matheson. I'm a spicy boy, boy. I'm a spicy boy, boy. Matheson and I like searched it up and I was like, yeah, that's, that's Maddie Matheson for sure. But uh, Maddie Matheson in Craig of the Creek, two of the best things ever. BMO, squares of this BMO. I just like looked at screenshot. Um, Encanto, I think was popping at this time when I drew this. More of my characters right here cylinders eyes practicing eyes um pokemons nothing to say about the pokemons but that gengar though that gengar um designing some props for my webcomic the name of my webcomic was called warped but i changed it since then but this is like simple little props i was doing plants shoes skates everything my oc for streaming i'm gonna stream on twitch this is what he looked like some more of my comic book stuff and then i did a redesign of spider-man's homemade suit don't like these glasses i hate them uh, i think these ones are like my favorites but i ended up going with like these ones love the symbol pretty good pretty good i like it a lot batman trying to do a batman in a cartoony style trying to figure that out kirby from here on i think on every page i draw kirby so i'm not gonna point it out but uh, in the comments or something like you could be like i saw the kirby there i saw the kirby there but there's a Kirby on every single page after that. Boom. Owl House stuff. Adventure Time stuff. It's like my favorite page, actually. I forgot what pen I used. I think it was a Micron. This is my favorite page. Day 29 is my favorite page, all right? You comment below what day is your favorite. We're on day 29 for so far. Boom. Some uh, Breath of the Wild stuff. I'm trying to change it up a little bit. Um, my webcomic. This is like an alternate clothing they wear inside of the game that they play, which is what they're... The, whole web comics based on a game more cylinders there we go next page is day 32 this is just random concept art i didn't really title this one because i ended up doing something else with this but this is uh turnarounds i was practicing turnarounds more web comic stuff regular show can you see kirby on this page uh, um Kirby's not on this page, I'll tell you that now, because this was another little TikTok thing where somebody's like, ah, do the die lit cover or something like that, Adventure Time or something, I don't remember. But it's a Playboy Cardi die lit cover as Adventure Time. And then here's my uh, webcomic characters again in alternate clothing. And then let's go to the next, this is day 35 already. Boom, this is some JoJo, couple JoJo's, my two favorite JoJo's actually. Try to find Kirby in that one. Uh, some one piece in my art style. I really like that Luffy. I might make this a prank. I kind of like this. Clean it up a little bit, but uh, try to find Kirby in that page. Turning Red came out around this time. Oh my god, I forgot about it. Turning Red and Luca are like my favorite Pixar movies right now. Used to be Ratatouille and Wally, but I'm about to say Luca and Turning Red are top tier. Some more Hollow Knight and some more cylinders. Man, there are a lot of pages in here. Moon Knight. Man, this is crazy looking at all this because. I, you could just tell what I was watching at the time. So here's some Moon Knight in a cartoony style. That Mr. Knight. I love that Mr. Knight right there. That one. And that one over here. Oh, this one's kind of cool too. Yeah, I like that one a lot. Find Kirby. Um, more of my characters. Alternate clothes. Trying to simplify it more. Um, find Kirby on that page. Gravity Falls. Try to find Kirby on that page. Um, my villain character messing around simplifying him a little bit more his shoes i plan on making them yeezys because i feel like yeezys are a villain shoe nobody nice is wearing yeezys on huh? i'm just kidding he's hella ugly right here i don't like that at all but here's my character again main character elden ring oh my god this is like a time capsule elden ring i was playing elden ring a lot during this time i was drawing his sword here and i believe i messed it up so i where you drew it over with a sticky note. That is day 45. Try to find Kirby on that page. Kirby's there, I'm telling you. Um, Black Panther redraws. Try to draw black, black. Trying to draw Black Panther in another like cartoony style. Ninja Turtles in my style. Trying some different stuff. Tall, lanky Donatello. Cylinders and squares. Some more cartoony Batman stuff. This is when the Batman movie came out. Eh, 
day 48 me I'm doing some uh, practice with the uh, line weight trying to get that steady line here are two circles lines just some practice man that's what the sketchbook is for the sketchbook is for practicing man and then this next page i like this next page a lot boom gorillas um i got a brush pen i believe on this one i was practicing with the brush pen it's all right and then this one i was trying out a ballpoint pen i believe but i like i like this one a lot this is my favorite one i would probably color this digitally or something next page i don't believe kirby's on this page maybe he is car doodles yes i drew this in the car also now i remember day 50. uh this is my desk i was trying to draw my desk i suck at perspective because this is supposed to be my glasses case and it's like all right more cylinders whoa cylinders dude i love drawing cylinders um t-shirt designs right here on day 52 uh shirt design sticker designs for my little brother now i'm getting to where this is where i started drawing for myself like i haven't posted any of this on like social media or tiktok or nothing but i'm creating another comment it's based on my little brother so this is going to be like some designs for him more shirt designs sticker designs i was trying to figure out like a cool logo i don't even know what that is um cylinders shirt design this is a shirt design i actually went with maybe i'll put a picture up but uh, i have shirts basically this dude's from like a planet where they feed on procrastination and they don't really feed on it but it's kind of like monsters inc where you know how like they, f they use the screams to power their world well this in his world they power their world with procrastination so like if you're feeling tired and lazy that's probably because this dude came up drained you took it to his ship took it to his planet now they're now they have like batteries and stuff like that that's the whole that's my whole goal behind this guy so more about that in the future okay next up we have this is like my most recent art about two weeks ago i started getting into gouache painting gouache so i did some gouache color pencils watercolor tallow creator i believe the only thing that's watercolor is this teeth and his shirt maybe because i started out with watercolor then i started doing gouache then i went over it with colored pencils i like this one a lot i might make that a print that's pretty um and then on the left side uh i entered the nickelodeon prop contest and i was drawing a bunch of props trying to figure out which ones i was gonna do so i went with this water bottle this backpack i shouldn't have went with the backpack uh i made like a gaming system this blowtorch and what else did i do i forgot i did five things though a ramen bowl i didn't win but i came in top 10 out of like 100 so i'm fine with that top 10 i want to whack them little into us or something like that it's pretty sick anyways next page the comic i'm writing for my little brother this is more expressions uh cylinders more expressions i like that one a lot i like this pose a lot this is my favorite head right here i was playing around with paint markers right here day 63 um, messing around trying to figure out some logos, stuff, paint markers. I really like this paint marker. These are Molotov paint markers, I think, or Molotov. I'm not sure. We're almost there, though. Uh, more webcomic stuff from my brother's story. Trying to figure out poses, sword. His, uh, costume he wears in his world. It's based on, like, Naruto, kinda. Ambu, but I'm gonna go with this mask right here. Cause there's like a crack here and then like a scratch here. And my brother, in real life, he has like a scar here and a scar here. So I wanted to make the mask similar to that. That's coming too soon, hopefully. Uh, next page, still messing around with that. And then this, I don't know why I didn't finish this page, but this was like a TikTok before and after thing, but I like the drawing a lot. It's ugly, I like that. Here's more of that mask, a little more cleaned up. I like that one a lot. Sword's pretty cool too. All right, next page is, this was another little Instagram Reels trending thing. I have like a painting I did of a uh, Jill Ski and it's supposed to be like, show your sketch before, show what it would turn into after. So I just made a quick sketch and then I showed the painting. More cylinders, more squares, practice, practice. And then this page, I believe I did a YouTube short on this. Uh, I've been practicing watercolors a lot. This is watercolor, all watercolor and then the details are with Prismacolor pencils. And then I started with the yellow base layer. So first it was yellow, then I did the skin color, then I did the blue, red, and then I just went over it with the pencil. Prismacolor pencil. I like this one a lot too. Trying to do more traditional work. And having a sketchbook lets me do that. Um, and then here, drew a bunch of random shapes. Tried to fill them in. They're ugly. I like this alien though. This finger. 
Um, I know the Alien was one of my favorites. The Skull, if you want to flip your phone or upside down or whatever you're watching us on. The Skull, the Alien, and then I had a uh, Rhino right here. I really like that Rhino from Spider-Man. This Wolverine is pretty cool. And I like a dude, oh, this dude with the big nose. I like that one a lot. It's like my favorite. Everything else is ugly, but I thought I'm doing this more. I like doing this. Oh, this school right here. I like that school a lot too. I think I want to do a page um, of shapes and just do skulls with those shapes. See if I can make skulls out of them. That'd be cool for like Halloween or something. I think I'm gonna do that. But next page is the last page. Top 10 pages. Rhino. So I drew this rhino and then I wanted to draw this rhino. But I wanted to have him like a Spider-Verse vibe where he, you know like the Kingpin, how he's just like all body, dude ain't got no neck. That's how I feel Rhino should look, short legs, big arms. I just wanted to push it, push it a little bit and try to get his little squinty eye mobster face. And uh, he's only gray, so I just like pulled out a gray marker. I have a, I think it's a Copic marker I think I have. And then a brush pen, I use a brush pen for this, but this is like one of my favorite pages, last page. Finished it on the 5th. That was what, five days ago? And then I put that it's uh, the last drawing. We know it's the last drawing. Finished, finished, 8 5, 2 2. Starting in December. That's eight months. That's like eight. That's like exactly eight months, right? I started in. Boom, boom, boom. December 8th. Yeah, it's like exactly eight months. Anyways. That's my sketchbook. I'm starting another one. I'm The goal for the next one is to finish it in 24 hours or 12 hours. I'm, I'm debating right now. I was, I was calculating it. If I do it in 12 hours, I would have to do 15 pages in two hours. Two hours of not stop drawing, I would have to do 15 pages. I could do that. I could do that. It's only like a 150 page sketch, but I could do that. Anyways, thanks for watching my sketchbook tour. My first ever sketchbook tour. Um, I have tons of sketchbooks from when I was younger. If you guys want to see those, I'll just skim through them. Um, none of them are filled up, though, because I was, like, one of them kids who would get sketchbooks, draw a couple pages, and then never touch that sketchbook again, and then get a new sketchbook. So, if you want to see those or, like, some old drawings, please comment below and say, yes, I want to see your old sketchbooks, and I'll make a video about it. Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and, uh... Comment your favorite page down below. My favorite page was 29. All right, have a good one. Peace out.